Commander Tony Garcia. Can everybody hear me? Okay, uh, a few minutes ago, somebody stopped, uh, said that they, they don't want the history of the Junta to disappear. Uh, well, we're veterans, and mostly we're Vietnam veterans. And history has a way of forgetting the veterans. But without the veterans, we wouldn't enjoy all the freedoms that we have here. Believe me, I've been to a lot of countries where they don't have freedom. They're fighting for the freedom. And we should thank God every day that we're safe at night and safe during the day. Uh, without further ado, Timo. Timo Reyes, yes, Ben Lupe. Uh, when we first started our group, nobody would help us. And Timo and Lucas stepped up, so uh, uh, we want to make a small donation to the South Texas Conjunto Association, and we hope that in the future we can even give you a little bit more. Thank you. Thank you very much, sir. Timo, you can help us out. I want to remind them, uh, they have a, a U.S. flag for veterans at the cemetery, and we will also help them out. And if you have a veteran, a loved one, a relative that needs a flag, uh, you may call them you know, on Facebook. Or there's a phone number there uh, because that's a, a very nice and, and a worthy program to, to support them with. Thank you. The Vietnam veterans are the oldest veterans around now, but they're not going to be on the road too. They're on the Kyoto. That is the government of the wearing line. Somebody say, how come you was wearing the Kachucha, the Vietnam veteran? You know why I wear it? Because I want to find people like him and relate. We relate. You see somebody else wearing a cap? Hey, brother. We see each other. We welcome each other back. The Vietnam veteran, we had the worst welcome to this country than any veterans from the past. But ourselves, welcome back, brother. Thank you. Welcome home. Thank you very much. I almost forgot to inform you. About two years ago, before the pandemic, our group, small group, we're not a national group, we're just a bunch of guys that went together. Meme and I went to Vietnam together. And uh, about two, before the pandemic, we were able to have enough funds to buy a helicopter that flew in Vietnam and was shot down twice. Uh, they brought the helicopter back to the United States and that was the last helicopter that was available anywhere in the world. So we got the last helicopter that was in Vietnam. We also have the flag, an American flag that flew at the U.S. Embassy in Saigon. And on November 11th, we're going to be dedicating the helicopter. We're going to donate it to the city and to all the Vietnam era veterans. So put it on your calendar November 11th at 10.30 in the morning at the Veterans Park. Thank you.